The carnival is the biggest public event of the year in Felixstowe. People come from Suffolk and beyond to enjoy two days of fun activities. The summer carnival is a great tradition here, but where did the whole idea of carnival actually come from? Community celebration is a part of every society, but the sort of public merrymaking and processions through the streets, and the word carnival itself, has Christian origins. It began as a celebration before the 40-day season of Lent preceding Easter. The word carnival actually means an absence of meat. Traditionally, Lent is a time of fasting, and on many days in Lent, meat is not eaten. Lent is a time for reflection and preparation for the most important festival in the Christian year, Easter. In countries that have a strong Catholic tradition, pre-Lent carnivals are still common. Many have taken on their own character with a mix of local customs, particularly in the Caribbean and South America, and they're often a long way from their Christian origins. In Britain, pre-Lenten carnivals died out with the Reformation, although Shrove Tuesday still exists as a relic of it. Carnivals made a return in the modern era as secular activities, usually based in the summertime, such as this one in Felixstowe, because the weather is better. So the connection with Easter has become lost. Unfortunately, in disconnecting carnival from its Christian origins, we lose the significance of it to our lives. Carnival reminds us of the vitality of life. In the colour, music, dancing, socialising, giving charitably, having fun, we're reminded of just how precious life really is. But why is life so precious? Having Lent and Easter after Carnival reminded people of just how much God loved them. And that love was expressed in the death of Jesus on the cross, in order that each of us may have a way to find forgiveness and life. Jesus said of those who are his disciples, I came that they might have life and they might have it abundantly. God wants you to discover the vitality of life that only comes through following Jesus. Why not ask him to reveal that to you today?